here is another Straths Bay uh, for your repertoire. It's a tune called John McAlpin. And uh, this tune, I know it actually not from jamming in sessions, but from playing for Scottish country dancing, which is something I love to play for. And um, John McAlpin is a title tune for a dance. That means there's a dance called John McAlpin, and this is the first tune you play in the medley of tunes um, for that dance. So I love it. I think it's a really sweet little soaring tune, and every time I play it, I actually think of uh, all the dancers dancing to it. So if you have a moment, you should check out Royal Scottish Country Dancing. You could YouTube some dancing and see how they do the Strathspey step. It's in the key of A major, and uh, the opening phrase sounds like this. You can see there's a lot of little steps and scales that we're using. We're walking up right at the beginning on the open A to the C sharp. Make sure before you start learning this tune, actually, um, to watch the Strathspey Groove tutorial video. Uh, Strathspeys, they're a special type of tune and they have a really different groove than a reel or a jig. They have this snappy rhythm. So up front there, you're going to play. And we'll do an up, up bow coming down. So you're going to snap down from the A to the F sharp. Back up to that A and then land on your E. And that next phrase sounds like this. So you're going to give it a little bit of a lift. And then slur this one. So from the top of the tune, it sounds like this so far with your pickup. So let's play John McAlpin with some more grace notes and some exciting bowings. And let's make it very dancey so all of the Scottish dancers will be very happy. Uh, so as I said a little bit in the simple version of this tune, we're going to start it off with a chord. If we're playing for dancing. You can also play this tune just in a session. Uh, and then you don't have to start it out with a chord. Um, but with the chord, I will then play the pickup with two up bows because I've just played this big chord on a down bow. So the pickup sounds like this. And then I'll hammer on into that C sharp. There's lots of places for flicks. You could play what I just played. Flick. Or you could also play in one bow, like a waterfall, which I kind of like better. That changes the vibe from da, dun, dun, da, da, to da, 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 da. Just makes it a little bit smoother. And allows you to swell in the middle of the bow. So a waterfall down to the B with a swell in the bow. And then another flick right here. Then you'll play your pickup. You want to kind of have this feeling of... So as you go down to that E, you can play a flick there. 